Well, that was one friggin' heavy load in the back of the truck, that's for damn sure. Friggin' putting all that stuff right where the dirt is, because there's no concrete that goes all the way in the back of the wall. But anyway, it's um, Thursday. Um, today we're working on uh, putting up the rest of the walls on the inside. Uh, we've got the insulation going in so it would keep me nice and toasty on the winter. Uh, due to the fact that I'm stick, and yeah. We got this one wall do we're just going to mark um, the wire on this wall just trace on the other side so that we don't freaking screw and then we're going to put the siding up the siding over here um, this is the color that we chose it's like a tannish color so yeah we weren't able to get the yellow to match the house but we got this stuff oh cotton candy floating by um with all them nails that's scrap metal right there so that's where we're at today guys I'm hoping to get get the rest of the pine all in place um, so it's all in get the light in I'm gonna put the one light right here still and we're gonna paint it and put the uh, siding up so that's pretty good but it's getting there I'm um, hoping today we'll get the siding up um, the walls all covered up here with the new plywood the ceiling all covered up with the plywood and I'm gonna pour the concrete tonight, let it sit overnight and it'll be hard in the morning. Um, but then again, everyone gets hard in the morning, so yeah. I felt loud. Um, I'm gonna do it with the rest of the pink stuff, like the little skinny pieces, I'm gonna stick them right up in the um, little eaves up in there, what you wanna call it, the soft vents. I'm gonna go right along, so keep me nice and toasty. I was using some of uh, Pisser's favorite stuff, uh, the great stuff spray foam there all you know, along the doorways all up in the roof there we get some whip in there so it's getting there uh, hoping tomorrow to build the new workbench that goes across um, finish painting trim and start moving everything back together so yeah this is where we're at guys oh, yes. um, Still got to trim out this window over here, but there's a guy very interested in this tractor, um, so I might come by later on today. Just gotta send him an email on what time. Um, so that'd be a really fast sell. Um, I don't know if you guys have saw my other comments in the comment below in the last video. Um, I got the thing running. The thing runs beautifully. Um, thing runs beautifully there's only one little problem notice the fact that it's in second gear notice that it's in high gear watch what happened when I turned the pulley look at the wheel nothing not a thing so I'm gonna see I'm gonna pop open the rear end see what it's like um, and see what happens um, see maybe if it's like a strip gear or maybe the pin or something came loose on the inside we'll have to check that out but that kind of sucks if not then I got quite a bit of scrap metal there except for the motor I'll keep the motor maybe the steering wheel I don't know I'll have to wait and see um what else the guy last night came by Ooh, Mountain Dew I need that hold on a second the guy came by last night gave us an estimate for the backyard um, he suggests that we use some concrete stuff but it's like chipped up concrete but we don't want to we don't really want to do it that way so we're just gonna try and get some dirt and just literally just fill in the whole backyard it'll be 20 times easier and eventually in the fall we'll put brick going all the way down so we'll have to wait and see guys so yeah it's getting there Tonight, um, I think I'll make a separate video for the concrete, and I'll post up this video along with a couple of other things, um, stuff like that. Bought myself a new saw today. It's not as not that bad. It's a 12 amp. Um, got it at Lowe's for 25 bucks or 26 bucks, so it's a pretty good deal. All right, guys. So here's where we're pretty much at. It's a pretty long day. 
some. Um, so, video is still going to continue. You can see I left off. We we're putting in the uh, Pink Panther insulation. We got the boards all up and in. Um, got the board over here all up and in. We got the door trimmed out, all the wiring's in. Um, so, we got the loft up in. I have to show you that maybe tomorrow. Something for me to really stand on. And there's really no light up there, but came out pretty good. Um, we gotta get two more pieces of plywood tomorrow. Uh, one for the workbench, and then I gotta finish at the top up there. So that's no big deal. But we got um, I'm just getting ready to start doing the concrete. Uh, this two by four or the two two by fours I nailed together. Um, that's gonna be where the drain is. And it's just wide enough so I can put the drain thing in. Um, so we're going to pour the concrete right around it, all the way up and in, all the way over, inward, over, and that way. Because there was never even concrete even here, so we figured, I'm also freaking pour it in. Already got it dug down, still got to put the wire mesh in, I'm going to get that out of my truck. But, yeah, that's a lot of freaking dirt right there. Show you what we got going on the outside here. Nothing new over there. Um, but we got all the, it's all painted up, stuff like that. We started with some of the side and we got the J channel in. Um, we're originally going to use uh, clapboard, but I um, figured out this stuff was cheaper. So, putting this stuff in, we're going to put one more piece up at the top. Got to trim that light out. What the hell? Um, got the grip PC in. So. Get that light in. We're gonna get the right box for it. I screwed up on that part, but yeah, there's that. J channels all up around the window. This is what it's gonna look like. Oh, dust. Um, little tiny piece we're gonna put up in here. Um, it is up and in. So it's getting there. Michael, I think tonight's gonna come by. He's gonna hook up the electrical. And we'll probably have some power. Power to the people. Yeah, freaking right. But I gotta go eat something. I'm begging her to pass out. Oh, look at that piece. You can't break right off. Snap. So, yeah. Oh, Pisser's favorite stuff. By the Sabotu. Great stuff. I think he used the bigger stuff. I think he used the black can for the bigger gaps. I don't know what he uses, but I know that's the stuff. But. Yeah, friggin' right some woo. Oh, I'll have to show you up top some of the handiwork I did. We got the uh, friggin' trim up too, so that's pretty good. But, alright, I gotta go in and eat. I'm getting ready to pass out. Mmm, cotton candy. Wanna have some? Alright guys, well it's 9.14, and here's where we're at. It's getting kind of late in the night right now, but... Let's make a video anyway. So here's where we're at. We got the concrete all poured. I'm just waiting for it to set up a little bit so I can even out some of the spots that I missed, like right there. Um, what I do is I put the wire mesh down. I drilled some rebar into the concrete. So there's like a two foot section here. Um, did every other block another four foot and a four foot section over. Um, couldn't quite get that part over there even though, but whatever. We'll fix in the morning with the thinner stuff. And. Um, yeah, I'm just waiting for it to set up so I can do the bull nose right across the uh, the gap right here for the little drain some bitch. So that'll be pretty good. Um, but it's getting there, guys. I'm thinking Saturday, possibly Sunday, um, we can start to move back in, start getting everything unpacked and stuff. But it's getting there. We got the outside light up. Um, all this. Here's a question for you guys. What do you think I should do? Paint the plywood all the way across, going over there, or do you think I should just leave it be? I got the paint, just don't know what to do. Let me know about that. So, and I might um, throw some sheetrock up here. It's only going to take me about an hour to do that. Um, so I don't know, I'll have to wait and see on that too. But, friggin', friggin' getting her done. Looks a whole lot better. Alright guys, well, talk to you guys in the morning. Keep on shooting the free world.